everyone, it's Melinda, and today I'm back with another video for you. And today we're going to be talking about what is in my bag. To get started, I have the Michael Kors Hamilton Tote in the medium size, and it's black with gold hardware. I really like it. I've had it a few years. It's my go-to bag. I use it. It just it goes everywhere with me. Just everywhere. Let's get started. These are just my gloves. It is winter time where I live. It gets quite cold, but not as cold as it could get. Thankfully, cause I don't know how much I'd be able to handle super cold weather, but you always want to make sure you got some gloves on you. I've been in plenty of situations where I'm walking home or I'm walking somewhere and it's cold and I need gloves and I don't have them and it's a problem. So always make sure we have our gloves in our handbag. The next thing I see here is just a patch of tissues. I get these from Kleenex. I like this collection because they put a lot of fun designs on them. But yeah, you know, winter time, a lot of people tend to get sick and sniffly, and I just always try to be prepared for that. Next thing here is this pouch. I got this at J. Crew a few years ago, and I like the polka dots a lot. It's one of my favorite patterns, and it's got a little heart closure, so that's really cute too. And then in here, I've just got some receipts and my, like, my work card, a Metro card because I was in New York recently. I've got my Metro Pass. The next thing in here is my day planner. Um, I bought this at Barnes & Noble. I love the color and then I like how the sides have the gold sort of painted thing going on. I think it's very pretty. And I just keep track of appointments, when bills are due, birthdays that are important for me to remember. And I also like to stick some to-do lists in here. And yeah, just keep, it keeps me organized. Next thing I see here is a bag of popcorn. Someone in my office made kettle popcorn and I had never had it before, I had discovered. And I tried it and it was delicious and I was like, oh my god, I need to buy some when I go grocery shopping. I didn't have to wait that long because the next day someone had a whole box of kettle corn bags and I was like, oh, I'll just help myself to one of those guys. And there we go. Oh my god, if you haven't had kettle corn, you need to try it. It blew my mind. Next thing I see here is just my glasses case. I don't have the best vision, so we always have to make sure we have these guys. And then I also have my hand sanitizer. I get the one with aloe from Target. I really like it. It's always good to have this on hand for when you're in a situation where you can't wash your hands. Because you're going to need something to clean them with. Because sometimes gross things happen and you need to take care of things. Next is my wallet. And, you know, it just has the standard, like, cards, ID, all that sort of stuff in it. But it's black leather. I got it from Michael Kors many many moons ago. In fact I'm due for a upgrade because this guy is he's looking a little worn. We'll just put it that way. The next thing I see in here is just my compact mirror. Next thing I see here is just my phone charger for my iPhone 6 which I mean I could show you guys if you want but yep just carry my charger. You never know when your phone's gonna die or how much battery or how long the battery is gonna be lasting, so you need to take care of things. And so I have two chargers actually. So one stays in my purse or it goes in my suitcase when I'm traveling, and then the other one stays in my house. Next, we have my pencil case, and I keep pens in here. Highlighters, my lip balm of the moment, which is the Soothing Touch Vanilla Chai Lip Balm. I bought it at Whole Foods recently. I have to say, the vanilla chai was very enticing. Because I love me some chai lattes. I love me the vanilla chai candle from Bath & Body Works. So I was super excited to find this. But I was kind of disappointed with its performance. I found it to be basically giving me lots of gumpy sort of build up and that's not cute. Yeah, and then I've also got a little a post-it note bookmark sort of thing here. Then I also have Benefits Ula Lift, which you could tell is much loved and very empty and nearly out. Um, and I just use this for an afternoon, midday, whatever sort of pick me up under my eyes. Mm -hmm. 
The next item in my purse is this guy, and it is the CoverGirl Lip Perfection Jumbo Gloss Balm in 255, which I believe is Berry Twist. It is on my lips today, and I'm actually going to untwist it and reapply right now. Because, you know, when in Rome and things. The next thing I see here is just my task planner. Um, I mostly use it for work things and I really like it. It's called the Emergent Task Planner and you can buy them in notepads or a three month supply booklet like this. And basically, you, I like to write the day here up at the top. I like to write the day here up at the top and then you list your three major tasks or projects that you're going to be working on for the day. And they actually recommend that you don't work on more than three major projects. But of course, if you've got a lot going on, you can list more here. And anything else that's going on that comes up, you can sort of jot down here. And then basically what you do is you write the start time here and you write like when you're doing things and you check you can check things off as you finish them and I really like it it helps me keep track of what I'm doing throughout the day next thing I see here is my pill case and I just keep my vitamins in here I take vitamin C and another vitamin every morning after breakfast and so I always make sure to have vitamins in my bag because if I don't eat breakfast at home that day I want to make sure that I can have my vitamins after I eat breakfast. So, I always have this guy, and it's purple and cute and little and tiny, and I got it at Walgreens in case anyone's curious. Next thing I see here are just my mints. I just like to keep them in my purse. I prefer mints over gum. Fun fact, my favorite are the green tea ones from Trader Joe's, but I got these when I was in Denver a little while back, and so when I ran out of my green tea ones, these guys got switched in, and I think I'm going to pop one right now because I'm kind of in the mood for some candy. Oh, yeah. Mmm. Next item I see here is just a little mint candy I got at work. It is brown with like green line thingies. I call this a chocolate mint. I don't actually know if it's chocolate mint. I'll find out when I eat it, but that's not going to be right now. Maybe I'll try this after. Next thing I see here are just my headphones. These are just the ones that came with the iPhone. And they, I like them because they've got the headset on it if I want to talk hands-free or something, which I don't do very often, but it's good to have the option. Next thing I see here is my other everyday lip color, and that is the NYX Butter Gloss in Tiramisu. And it just looks like this. Between the CoverGirl Jumbo Gloss that I'm wearing today and this one, these are the two I alternate for everyday wear. Um, I really like how smooth this glides on. I really like the smell. It smells like dessert. Really delicious dessert. Like cupcakes or something. And oh man, I can smell that all day. <laughs> all the days. Um, but I really like it. It's a nice neutral color. And yeah. Nothing more I can really say about that. This mint is good. Oh man. What else do we have here? Here I just have a Taylor's of Harrogate Organic Peppermint Caffeine Free Tea. I like peppermint tea for when I'm stressed out or if I'm not feeling well. Just for as like, you know, a pick-me-up. It doesn't have caffeine in it so I don't have to worry about it making me crazy because I've got enough, I drink enough coffee every day. We don't need, we don't need more crazy out of me. And it's just, it's got a nice flavor and I like it. And it's good. Next thing I see here are my business cards. I, you know, green stripe on the back. I won't show you the front because that's got personal information on it, like my full name and phone number and things like that. And the last thing I see here is just my Kindle. And it's an older one. I got it a few years ago for Christmas. And I have this in my bag right now because the book I've just started reading 
is I bought it on the Kindle version. And yep, that was definitely everything that's in my bag. I hope you enjoyed today's video. Um, if you like this video, give it a thumbs up and please, please subscribe. I would love to have you stick around for more videos. And, you know, tell me what's in your bag. You know, you can film a video response and leave it in the comments. You can list it out. You can tell me what your favorite items in your bag are. Any and all of that would be wonderful. So I really would love to interact with you guys more. So just let me know down in the comments because I want to know about you. I hope you all are having an amazing, amazing weekend, day, whenever you're watching this, and I'll see you next time. Bye!